Look here. That is the face of a little champion walker. Erin, I'm so proud of you. We're taking Erin for a walk today and we are going to try and, and achieve one kilometer of walking. Her record so far is 780 meters. Part of the, the whole thing is just trying to get her shoes on. <laughs> just the way I'm sitting here, she could actually kick me somewhere where I don't want to be kicked. Yeah, so we use these high top shoes. And um, the reason we use these is because... Oh, Erin! <laughs> is because Erin's feet are, um, are quite soft. You see how they bend in like that? Um, sorry, can you see her foot there? Yeah. See that? Yeah. What is that? Pronate, antenate. What is that, sweetie? Antenation or pronation? I think it's pronation. Yeah, we think it's pronation. Um, probably should check that out just now. Maybe I'll upload that in the comments. Um, so we've got to get her tackies on, and that's part of the hard part. Here in South Africa, we call these tackies. We call them sneakers in America. Okay, let's get your shoes on, Erin. So what we've got here is her shoe, and I've loosened up those, those laces quite nicely. And then we have a little insert, so these help to just keep her ankles straight. Pop that on. Now to try and get her foot in here, and that's quite a challenge, because she sort of pulls her toes when I try to put her shoe Get her foot in. <laughs> oh, she's excited though, she's really keen for her walk. Okay, so this is the tough part. You know, these high, high tops are great because they give ankle support, but try, trying to get her toes in straight is the challenging part. So, we need like a. What are those things called? A shoe hook? Mm. What are they called? Oh. Help me out, Erin. <laughs> yeah, let's loosen it up more. Okay. If anyone's got tips on, on shoes that are easier to get on, I'd love to hear about it. But sweetie, you found those things where you slide the foot in from the back, hey? Mm -hmm. And then it closes like this. Yes. Okay, so we, we need to look at We're visiting the grandparents at a beautiful little village called De Calders near Hanspai, which happens to be, I, I guess you could say, the great white shark cage diving capital of the world. Um, I don't know if there's better great white shark diving anywhere else, but it's pretty good out here. Not that we do it much at all, but anyway, that's besides the point, really. We are gathered here today to watch this little champion, Erin Boshard, attempt one kilometer of walking. Are you ready, Erin? You got your little buff on your head, and you got your little little uh, tackies on there. And we are ready to go. All right, Erin, let's go for it. One kilometer, let's go, whoops. Okay, I'm gonna, I'll catch up with you guys on YouTube a bit later. I need to hold both of Erin's hands and I don't have anyone else to help film this so I'll get back to you just now.
Hey guys, we did it. We did one kilometer. Look at this little champion. She did it. Erin, you did one whole kilometer of walking. Well done. Come look at everyone. Come look here. Don't be so shy. Look here. That is the face of a little champion walker. Erin, I'm so proud of you. We did one kilometer. I didn't even know we had got that far. You're amazing, Erin. So, it just shows you guys. Um, you know, these, these kids, even though they might have special needs and, and they've got a lot of challenges, they're, they're not made of porcelain. That's one thing we need to remember. And, um, you know, somewhere inside their minds, there's things going on that we, we can't really comprehend. And, you know, Erin... Whoopsie. Erin... Um, Erin has, you know, she gets really excited and she she kicks her legs and there comes a car. She she um she definitely has has this like this need to exercise and and you know she she wants to get out there and she wants to do things. So I think um, these walks are really cool and thanks everyone for the support. I'm I'm pretty amazed that we got to one kilometer in a relative, relatively short space of time because it was December last year, like just before Christmas, I think, when we started this thing. And today we did it. I mean, I wasn't even keeping an eye on the phone. I was using a tracking app on the phone and it looks like we did 1.17 kilometers and then Erin started to complain. So that's when I know she's had enough. But, um, and look, I mean, now she's fine. She, she kind of moans and lets me know you know she can't speak yet so she she just moans and makes a noise and that for me that's a telltale sign that she's had enough but you can see now she's happy now that we've stopped i think she's really really happy she's rubbing her eyes that means she's tired we understand her language her little errand language <laughs> i'm just so proud of you i'm so proud of you oh you got just snollies and spit all over your face Let's just wipe it off. Come, you're on TV now. Let's wipe it off. Come, we need to look good for the TV. Oh no, no, rubbing more spit everywhere. Erin, I'm really proud of you. You did one kilometer of walking. That's amazing. We'll bring that out if anyone wants that. Trace? Yes? So guess what? What? Erin did one kilometer. What? Oh, wow. She did it! Woo! Yeah! Woo! She did it! Erin! Yeah! Well done! <laughs> Great job, Erin! Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Also you! High five! Boosh! Erin walked one Amazing. kilometer rain. Amazing. Say well done, Erin! Tell Erin well done. done. Say well done, Erin! <laughs> Say well done, Erin. I'm done, Erin. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you. You did well, Erin. Well done.